What's up guys, and with the video of today, I'm officially back uh, creating content. If you wonder why I've been away for a couple of months, it's because I had to move from an house uh, to another, and uh, that wasn't uh, easy at all, since I have to move the studio and everything, and uh, with the human malware, it uh, wasn't easy. So it took me a lot of time, and I'm still working on the new set, since here, what you see here, would be the back of the new studio and this is temporary just to make the content uh, about the new stuff that is going on this month so you will probably see in a month uh, or maybe two a new studio on the other side of the camera and uh, i can tell you that it's going to be really cool but this is, is going to take some time and in the meantime i want to restart making cool stuff all right now i want to share with you what are my plans uh, for the next month or two let's start with the first topic zen free Yes, I will cover Zen3 in every model and as always World of Warcraft, Extreme Overclocking, Overclocking Guide, Tuning Guide, Memory Tuning Guide again, since it's never enough, and the usual stuff. Plus uh, some application benchmark uh, that I want to integrate uh, to my benchmark suite like uh, uh, Blender, uh, Photoshop and many more. And this will happen as soon as I can buy uh, CPUs, since uh, I hope this time they will be ready at launch. Big Navi. Again, yes, I will cover the new AMD GPU, probably the 6800XT and the 6900XT. Usual stuff, uh, plus extreme overclocking, overclocking guide, uh, crazy and funny test, uh, same as always. RTX 3000 series. Well, I hope that uh, I will be able to buy one or two or three to make some tests and the reviews, but I don't know when. Probably you know better than me that since it's impossible to get one, but when I get my hands on it, I will do same as Big Navi, full test, extreme overclocking, overclocking guide, usual stuff. But uh, I don't know exactly uh, when I will be able to have uh, one here. So in that case, be patient, and uh, as soon as I have one, you will see that in this channel. World of Warcraft Shadowlands. This is a very delicate topic right now, since uh, in a couple of days we will have the Zen3 to be able to test it and to see if they are going the best CPU for gaming or not, even in World of Warcraft. And then I'm going to wait for Big Navi and the RTX. So uh, I have to pick the best CPU to test the GPU and I have to pick the best GPU to test the CPU. And since we are waiting this big uh, disruption, in theory, of the new components coming now, in this month, I'm a bit undecided of what platform I'm using. So I want to pick the best uh, CPU to test the CPU, the GPU, and to pick the best GPU to test the CPU. So I think we have to wait a bit. I'm going to cover it since I have the beta access, and I'm going to create some content in these days, probably with the, the new Zen coming out. So I'm going to do a live stream and some events and some videos talking about that but before going for a complete roundup you have to wait uh, since uh, i can find the best platform since i want to i want to give you uh, the results that i'm going to use uh, for making more episodes let's say if i find out that the big navi is the best gpu for testing the cpu of world of warcraft i'm going to use one card for all the cpu i'm going to test and since i have cpu that is going back to the early 2000s, so I have 20 years of CPU here, and I want uh, to test everything to give you some comparative and, well, uh, even some funny video, but I want to make sure that I'm going to use only one GPU for all the testing, since it's going to take months. I think you understand that, so uh, be patient, but uh, I will give you some content and some insight before the official release of Shadowlands, so you can build, or at least uh, give, you an, give you an idea of what is going to be heavy or not, and what is uh, more or less the best components you can plan to buy now to be ready for the new expansion. Now I want to talk about something that is not completely related to PC hardware, but is more like uh, nerdy stuff. Uh, as you can see there, I have a 42 unit rack that I have some NAS and some PC components inside, but is also filled with uh, solar components uh, lithium battery and everything because I have like five kilowatts of uh, solar panels outside that is powering this house and this studio so everything you see here is from the sun and I had to do it because I had some issue with the power grid that after three months 
I have in this house, like yesterday, but uh, I had to build everything to catch the power of the sun, to power all the studio in my house. So I'm going to talk about that in some video that I'm going to do dedicated, so at least if you are not interested in the topic, you can skip that video. But I think it is uh, something that is pretty cool, since uh, there's a lot of uh, nerdy stuff going on, a lot of cables, uh, uh, a lot of calculation to make it work, and this is pretty interesting. There's another thing that I want to talk about, is a studio tour. Since uh, many of you asked me to do a studio tour, now that I'm rebuilding the studio, uh, I think it's a good time to show you what I'm using for testing the components, my extreme overclocking rig uh, and everything. So in the next uh, weeks, uh, I'm going to keep you updated about uh, what is going on on the other side of this camera and show you some of my equipment, my streaming rig, my lightning and everything. And if you want to know even more in the details of what is going on here and behind the scenes, I suggest you to check my Patreon. You can find the link in the description below. And by the way, thanks for all my Patreons because uh, everything you see here is because I've bought it myself. This is an independent channel and I'm not sponsored at all. So again, a big thanks that uh, you are helping me to support uh, all the things, the crazy things that I'm doing here. So now uh, let's get to work uh, and produce some benchmark. I have some unfinished benchmark uh, to put, uh, to translate uh, into video since uh, I didn't stop benchmarking even if I had a lot of mess around here. And well, we will see in the next one very soon.